back here on the Trib Live High School Sports Network center stage with 3A, 2A, sorry, breaking up the three feet. Macy McElhaney, a 3 2 sets uh, uh, Victor today over Freeport to break it up. First, let's see the, the gold medal and the, and the uh, trophy she's carrying around. Huge kill to end the match. That was your 30th kill and 10th block. Can you believe those numbers? I mean, is that something you ever shoot for as a specific number? Yes, I'm always trying to go higher and higher than the last time. And I think today I came out and I knew that I had to swing as hard as I can and swing smarter than I ever have. And also fighting, it feels like, with Alexa Mamone every time. She ended up with 23. Do you guys ever have that friendly competition of who gets more kills uh, oh, during yes. a match? All the time, all the time. Since freshman year, we've been pushing each other, like back to back pushing each other. I'm going to get more kills, and then I'm going to get more kills and make each other better. Uh, early in the match, obviously things not going well at all for Bobcats. Went down 9-0 yeah. in that opening set. What's going through your mind when just things don't seem to go right in that opening junction? Well, I'm not of us are too sure what happened in that first set, and we decided that, because our coach called time out, we talked about it, we decided that we weren't going to come back to win that set. We had to come out of the second set, the third set, the fourth set, and the fifth set. We had to play our hardest and our smartest to win this. And in those middle sets is where you started to really pick up your game, getting a chunk of your kills in that uh, third set. There was one point from the back line, you were waving your hand saying, I want it, I want it. Is, is that just, you know, you feel that you're getting the hot hand, so you're telling your teammates, give me the ball? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm a very, very competitive person, and I knew that I wanted to win that, so I was like, set me. I was like, I'm going to do I was like, we're going to win, and I'm going to help. Now, being here last year, playing against Freeport in, in a tight match there, well, won a set against them last year, what did that mean to come back this year? What did you learn from last year that helped you get all the way and get the championship this year? Last year we learned that they were a very smart program. They're very tough. They're very, they're an all-around very solid program. And we've been training for this all year. Since the beginning of the season, we're like, Freeport does that, so we need to learn how to do it. We need to learn how to pick that up and play for that. And we went out and scouted them, and we saw what they had, and they got better from last year. We knew that we had to keep getting better if we wanted to make it here. What did it mean to have your center back tonight as well, when Courtney had to miss the uh, semifinal game? I mean, obviously you had someone you were familiar with, with the, uh, your sister yeah. stepping in there, but what does it mean to have the, the normal routine back in store for tonight? She is the most stubborn person I've ever met, and I am so proud of her. I took her to the athletic trainer today, and she said, just tape it, I'm playing. She said, I want to win this. We're playing, we're winning. And it meant oh, it meant so much to the entire team that she pushed through that and came back and helped us. And what does it mean to you, final question here, to be able to give Coach Horwath the uh, North Carolina Championship here? Oh my goodness, since seventh grade, she's been telling us, she's like, you're tall, you're tall, you're strong, we're going to get this. She's like, I want this. It's never happened before. She told us that she's tired of getting the second place and she finally won the first place. So I think we're all extremely happy that we could give it to her after all this time. Oh, silver last year, gold this year. Show it off. Congratulations to champion Beaver Bobcats, Macy McElhaney, here on the Trip Live High School Sports Network Center stage.